Morley. Um, how was the funeral? Um, what Ramsay would have chosen, thank you. And the service? I'm, I'm in a bit of a, a hurry, Sophie. I'm sorry. How about this one? Ben, she's in her 70s. She's not going to want to be doing all them steps, is she? Well, I don't know. I've never shot for OAP holidays before. What you doing? I'm just finding some stuff out from your bishop. He had this idea, right? Do you remember that bloke's fancy that died? What, Norris? No, not Norris. Norris's brother. What, Norris has got a brother? Honestly. It's not in a celebrity magazine, it's just not interesting. Yes, Rosette, Norris had a brother, right, that died. But he used to live in Australia, so I thought it'd be nice if Emily wanted to take a trip out there. Why? Well, I don't know why, but it's just a nice thing to do, isn't it? Being a good neighbour. What, because G's this one? No, because I like Emily, right? She's the only one around here who understands me. Oh, yeah, you and Emily Bishop, best mates. You, saddo. Just excuse my sister, just because her boyfriend don't want to see her tonight. Yeah, for your information, he just want to see me. He's just arranged to go out with his mate, Lloyd. So, this Emily hasn't said she wanted to go to Australia? No. Well, I've seen your people tours, didn't I? You know, I think you should put yourself in one. You could go with her. You could spend a few weeks with a rug around your lap, talking about God and fishing scarves. <laughs> just so you know, I'm praying for you. We both are. Aren't we, Ben? Yeah. You two just aren't normal. This is the company and um, basically they, they fly you out and there's coaches that take you all around Australia, you know, so you get to see everything. Well, that's very thoughtful of you. And, um, well, I thought Rita might want to come, you know, if you fancied it. I certainly looked through it. <sighs> And I must say, I, I'm very pleased to meet you, Ben. Sophie's told me a great deal about you. Well, you've got a very nice house. It reminds me of a grand. She's got a piano, too. Do you play? Me? No, no. No, Ben swims. He's really good. Go on, ask her. Shut up. She wants to ask you something, but she's too embarrassed. You know, I wish I'd not told you now. <laughs> ask away. I don't bite. Do you want me to get that? Oh, please. Well, you know, like I was um, thinking of getting baptised. Yes. Well, um, if I do, they want us to have someone to stand up and talk about us, um, a Christian that's known as a whale, and, um, well, you've known me since I was born. You'd like me? to talk at your baptism. Yeah. Oh, Sophie. But I'd be honoured. Hey, don't cry. No, no, I'm sorry, it's just done. Um, no, I'm, I'm, I'm very flattered. And thank you for asking me. You've had a delivery? The man just left it in the room. Oh, what is it? I'm not sure. Oh. What's that? Rose? What? What's it like to be in love? I don't know. So you don't love Luke? You just have sex with him? What, is this leading up for you to tell me that I'm going to go to hell? No. I just want to know how it feels. You know, how do you feel when you're in love? Uh. Well, I don't know. I suppose you just want to be with them all the time. And you know how I used to shoot loads of gum? Well, I don't anymore because Luke said he didn't like it. And that's because I love him. So you're going to marry him? I don't know. I mean, I'd like to. Because he's gorgeous, isn't he? Yeah, but he's old. <laughs> yeah, well, age gaps don't matter. I mean, look at Demi Moore and Ashton Kutcher. Age gaps are in. Yeah, but you're not waiting for the age gap, are you? Of course not. 
I mean, I like the way he talks. He knows about stuff. He's been places. He's really funny. He's great. Well, he must be to put up with you. <laughs> I think I'm falling in love with him. Are you just supposed to love Jesus? Sophie, why are you really going to church? Is it to make Ben like you? Of course not. I just like the way it feels, you know, when I read the Bible. It makes sense. I feel like Jesus is actually speaking to me. Well, isn't it just full of rules? Like not having sex. See, that's the thing. God don't make you stick to rules. It's your own free will. It's like I could go out tomorrow and nick some it. But then, how would I feel after it? Just no point in putting yourself through it. You know, I don't like it when you say that you're praying for me. Hmm. I am. You will, I don't want you to pray for me. Yeah, but I am, and I always will. Why? Is that because you think I'm a bad person? No. It's because you're my sister. Ew! Look how fat she is. Oh, that is just gross. Ew!